Welcome back, everybody. Patty Spittler is here, brought to us by Pet Pals TV with some really, or at least one, but two really big friends. They're Great Pyrenees. Jane Rose is also with us, who runs the Great Pyrenees Rescue here in Indianapolis. Wow. Jane, we're glad to have you here. Thank you. 17 years they've been doing yes, this. Pulling this off. Since, since 2002. Is, oof, yes. Taking I care mean, of these big boys. It's, <laughs> it's, it's, it's wonderful to rescue the small animals, too, but when you're rescuing 150 pound dogs. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's a lot. A, that's a lot of, that's a big challenge. How many do you have in rescue right now? We have now? about 28 in rescue right now. Wow. Well, why would somebody surrender uh, their Great Pyrenees? Or how do some of your rescues come in, I guess? Most of them come in from animal shelters because they stray away. Okay. So if you don't have a fence, They'll these walk. guys They're are wrong. wrong. They They're, make they're their own adventure territory. explorers. Yes, Part of the they, breed. They carve out their own territory. They bark. They're bred to bark to ward off predators. Right. And uh, they're extremely big and they uh, shed. Okay. But those are not really the most of the reasons. It's mainly the, the wandering and the barking. Wandering is how they end Because Patty always says, know your breed. Yes, they're all, you I mean, do. You need yes, to know they're your all breed. lovely companion animals, but they're all different too, and part of it is part of the breed. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, these guys want to go. Now, the good news is, uh, like children, they don't care about the kids. They you can't hurt them. Uh, yeah, I just love you. And, <laughs> and also, you see, like they were bred to in the Pyrenees Mountains to guard sheep and sheep and goats. Okay. Sheep and goats. So you that see them on, like, yeah. on yeah. Facebook. You'll see like a little goat jumping on them. They don't care. Yeah, they're, they're fine. They're big. They're sturdy. So they were originally bred to kill bears and wolves. So, oh my goodness! Yeah, <laughs> uh, when they're in, doing their work out in the mountains, um, they are very lazy. They just lay with the flocks and kind of blend in yeah. and then if a bear wolf comes along they go bark and <laughs> tell them they're there yeah, yeah. Say, sorry you need to leave and then if they don't <laughs> leave then well so that could be a nice outcome. So what's the difference between these two here then? Because they're both great Pyrenees, but they have different facial features. He I'm is noticing. a mixed breed. He has some terrier in him, so he okay. is not a purebred. Okay. But we do rescue, uh, you know, mixed along with mm -hmm. the regular, uh, the purebred great Pyrenees. Okay. Gotcha. And, and also, you do some uh, really good work. I just had my buster, my kitty that I lost about four years ago, but I wanted to give him a proper Earn. So mm -hmm. tell us what you do here, Jane. Well, what I do there is um, Patty had Buster passed away about four years ago, it's but she Buster. was not happy with, uh, you know, the container Buster was in. It so just wasn't it special. It wasn't special. So uh, she came in and selected one that she can feature his photo in, and then his remains are behind the photo in the urn, mm -hmm. and we had it engraved and everything. So it's very. Uh, very dignified. And, and from what I understand, you're a pet loss specialist a, and am. a companion who you really understand what people are going through with this and then of course the kinds of things they may need to get through it. Yes, I have my certification um, in pet loss and uh, what I do is help people through their mourning process mm -hmm. when they do lose a pet. Uh, some of the things I brought here today are new and things people may not have seen before. Okay. They Look are uh, a way that you can put your uh, pets cremains. And there you are in the chapel. Yes, mm -hmm. there we are in the chapel. You can incorporate your pets cremains in either jewelry or a beautiful glass memorial like the heart that's And you said there. that's not necessarily just a container to hold ashes, but that they're blown into the glass yes. and they become part of that piece of, yes. of memory, that jewelry there. So some people like these because you can wear your pet with you, like I have my girl Sophie on today. Oh, and you're right in your yeah. white necklace. Or you can, um, you know, maybe they're gonna scatter the ashes, but they wanna keep a remembrance. Mm -hmm. So then they have like the heart piece done. My goodness. Now, there was one more thing I wanted to tell and share with you about Indy Great Pyrenees Rescue. Yes. Is we just get our uh, certificate of silver transparency through GuideStar. Okay. And GuideStar is like the good housekeeping seal of approval for not for profit. So it's a big deal if you get um, approved by them. Nice. So we are one of, uh, there's only 2% of the not for profits in the country that have these. <laughs> well, so, congratulations. So we're very excited about the that. The dogs are thrilled, I'm the sure. The dogs are very happy. So they're that means your, your donations go where they're <laughs> supposed to go and they're used Whoops. as you. Watch that. Are you coming up Whoops. here with us? <laughs> <laughs> That's another problem with Pyrenees. They're so still the tails. tails. They'll the tail. the table off, no <laughs> yeah, problem. Yeah, so if you have a lot of tchotchkes, you may want to reconsider. Now, folks at home might be wondering, he's got he's got part of him shaved. He Can did. He, he, had, uh, he had a hot spot, so okay. that is contact uh -oh. dermatitis. Just for, oh, got to go see Marcus. Head, uh, <laughs> go see Marcus. We lost Go see Marcus. So uh, he had a little, okay. so that it's nothing serious. Nothing serious, nope. just part of his treatment. <laughs> we, we Live lost, TV. We lost what our crew is having a good time. <laughs> Oh, I'm so sorry, Superman. Yeah, yeah.
Okay. I know. <laughs> well, well, look at all this love. <laughs> we, and, and you can't have a lot of black pants. Zane, they they won't stay yeah. black for long. <laughs> Lovely to have you on, Zane. We'll have more info, of course, on Thank you, Brenda. Memorial Service online. <laughs> Patty, you always know how to bring Thank them. Thank you. Isn't this great? Isn't this? Oh, he's going to go over and see Marcus now. Hey, Oops. do not pee on see that. Marcus. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hiding in the... Hey, come here. Clark. Just don't, I just don't lift He's your leg. No, 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 no. Clark, come here. Right. Come here, Clark. There come we here. go. Come on, on over here, Clark. Come Look at that. No. <laughs> oh, see, Marina. We're gone. All right, Marcus, you better save us from ourselves. <laughs> more, they're way more entertaining than we are. We'll just do the next 15 minutes of them.